Okay. Um, I'm on a chase lounge right now, so work with me, guys. Okay, this this works, right? Yeah. Yeah, this works. We're gonna do what's in my purse today. You guys are crooked. Can you live with it? No, you can't. Uh, yeah, good, awesome, okay. What's in my purse today? Woo! All right, fine. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing today. Super duper exciting. Um, I'm filming so much today, it's kind of crazy. These past two days have been absolutely insane. Um, I'm trying to film as much as I can because um, uh, number one, I love it. And number two, I really just want to film. Um, anyway, so I have filmed this video three times and every single time something has gone wrong. I feel like that's what's happening with all my videos recently. Um, but yeah, this time um, it's not going to go wrong. It's going to go perfectly well. You guys are going to see the bag this time. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna run out of storage. <laughs> that did happen um, back when I had my old phone. I was filming this video and I ran out of storage um, all the time. That happens all the time, not anymore though, because I have a new phone. Anyway, it's not really new anymore. It's, I've had it for a month now. It's still new, that's new, whatever. Okay, stop talking, start moving. <sighs> this bag was bought at TJ Maxx for 20 whole dollars. Cheapo, but whatever, I love it. Um, this is by the brand MMS. I did check out their brand's website. Um, this is kind of like where I saw the logo. <laughs> um, I, check, I checked out the brand's website and most of their bags um, range between the 40 to 60 price range. Basically, they claim to be luxury without the luxury price tag. Um, this is made out of vegan leather, so not leather, but... Um, it's not like a plasticky leather. It's like very, very soft. Um, and it's made out of other natural synthetic fibers, not plastic though. Um, <laughs> not plastic, cause that would make it cheap. Um, anyway, so yeah, it's, it's vegan leather. It's fake. <laughs> Bottom line, it's fake. Um, okay, moving on to the compartments. Um, it has two compartments on the inside on the main bag of this. So it has this little pocket right here. That's where I put my phone screen facing inwards to protect it. And then it has this nice little zipper pocket right here. And back in here, I keep um, earbuds. I keep a charger and I keep um, a blessed rosary. I'm Catholic, if you don't know. Um, and I also keep a iPhone adapter to the audio jack. Um, and then I also just have some other prayer cards in here. Um, and like, this is just like a little pamphlet of like just Catholic teachings um, and you know, like just really basic stuff about our religion. Um, like it just has really basic prayers and stuff. And I like having this in here. So if I wanna pray a rosary, I can just pull this out and it gives me the um, days of the week and which mystery I'm playing. I'm praying, not playing, praying. Um, <laughs> Anyway, so yeah, that's what I have in this pocket. I can actually fit a lot back here in this little pocket because I don't use this stuff all the time, but I like having it with me all the time um, because it's all so light and it really doesn't add that much to the bag. You know, it's just, it's nice to have it there. Um, oh, I forgot something. <sighs> Hang on, I'll be right back. Pretend those were in there the whole time. All right. Yeah, so that's what's in the two compartments in there. And then it also just has like this nice little zipper pouch, front pouch right here. So those are like the compartments of the bag. <sighs> in the big open space of here that I've had in here the whole time of this video, first I have my wallet. This is by Steve Madden. Um, I got it for $15 at TJ Maxx and I love the beautiful emerald color. I think it's so, so pretty. I love the gold hardware on both of these. Um, and yeah, it's pretty, I like it. So I keep, it has plenty of room for credit cards. Um, nice coin little pouch right here. I can keep cash in this compartment. Notice how it's empty. <laughs> Um, and then like back here, I can keep my like receipts and stuff. And then over here, I even like keep my little house key, um, just to make sure like I have it on me at all times. I really like that this has a wristlet so I can pull this out of my bag and then just have this like go into stores whenever I'm in a rush or something. Um, so yeah, that's really nice. Um, that's a nice little, <laughs> this is so uncomfortable. Okay. So yeah, that it's nice. It's a nice little 
wallet. I, I enjoy it. I really, really love that. And I feel like this is a really good color for... I feel like this is a really good color for summer and fall as well. So yeah, yeah, that's fun. Okay, next, these two pouches that were in my purse the whole time. These are just like nice little pouches that I keep stuff in. This has feminine products. When you're on that time of the month, you need to keep stuff on you just in case. So I have this in here and I only like, and it's nice to have it in a separate pouch. So like I can put it away and refill it and like keep it in a drawer when I'm not on it. So it's not always in living in my purse, but whenever I like am on it, like now I can <laughs> just, you know, stick it in my purse and it's nice and discreet and yeah, I like it. Um, and then in here I have some ibuprofen, which is also necessary at some times of the month or if I'm just really having a bad day. <laughs> and then also this clarity, um, um, like mix of essential oils in a rollerball. Um, I got this at Earthbound and oh my gosh, I have really just like associated the scent with productivity and that sort of a thing. So I love having this on me, especially during the school year after school, like I'll go to the library and just work. Um, it's not school yet, but it will be. <laughs> and I'm definitely going to be keeping this with me. Um, so yeah, I am actually going to be permanently keeping these two pouches in here for the next couple um, of days. Um, I also just have like this pen in here. Um, I don't really know where to put it yet. Um, but yeah, I just have a pen and it has like a stylus thingy at the end. So that's just nice to have around. I feel like pens are handy. Um, so yes, I had this like kind of connecting to that like pocket right there. Um, but yeah, so that is what is in this first big pocket. Um, yeah, I, I love it. I love it so much guys. So moving on to the front pocket, this is kind of where I keep all my touch up kind of a stuff. Um, I don't really keep makeup in my bag. I do keep lip glosses and lip products and stuff however and i also keep a facial spray so this is from mario badescu and it's their aloe chamomile and lavender spray and i'm running out i'm like almost out like basically out um i have the two ounce um little canister of it in here i like having this with me especially particularly yeah this is out um i like well hang on i have another one i guess this is like a declutter and um clean and put stuff in reorganize my bag type kind of a thing yeah we're done okay it's gone <sighs> so in here <laughs> i'm keeping a rose water spray um this is from germany actually all right we have german company in town right now and it's awesome it's super fun they're awesome people we've known them forever and ever since before i was born um anyway long story short they brought this from Germany and I'm keeping it in my purse <laughs> um it is just a rose water spray and this is the brand. So if you live in Germany, I'm gonna try it out, review it for you. Um, anyway, yeah, I really, I've already used this once. The mister is really intense, but it smells so good. So it's like kind of one of those sprays I think that I'm gonna have to like spray first and then like get my face into because it is like such an intense spray. Um, but it smells so fantastic. So really excited about having this in my purse now. Okay, cool. Um, and then do we have to talk about the amount of lip products that's in here? It's kind of disgusting, but that's okay. Um, so I have <laughs> one, two, three, four five six seven eight wow that is a lot i have eight lip products in my bag right now that's kind of too much um but i like we can go through it right because like these are products that i trust with me to carry in my bag that's a lot so first off i have some burt's bees chapstick good old lip balm this is their vitamin e and peppermint scent flavor whatever you want to call it really do love this chapstick um another like lip balmy chapsticky kind of thing is this dr pawpaw rich mocha balm it is a multi-purpose soothing balm with natural pawpaw um anyway i had this on my lips earlier in this video um it's probably rubbed off um but i do kind of like this balm i at first whenever i first opened this i was kind of expecting it to be more of like a rosy nude but it is like a deep chocolate brown um so you get a little bit a little bit and then you ride it around and you rub it around really well 
because if you have darker skin tone this like if you have darker skin this would be ideal but if you don't then you really just have to take a little bit and rub it around it was three bucks at tj maxx um so i'm gonna keep it and i'm gonna use it but it's not ideal yeah whatever keeping it in my purse though um or not keeping it in my purse i don't know should i yeah we'll keep it in my purse and we'll put this um in my nightstand yeah that's what we're gonna do um okay next i have this becca glow gloss in the shade fox glove you guys have heard me talk so much about this on my channel such a beautiful lip gloss um i love that and then this is the revlon color burst um balm stain and i have it in the shade honey de J. it's in a very similar tone to the becca glow gloss um but i just love the format of these lipsticks so beautiful i have another one of those balm stains by revlon and this is in the shade rendezvous which is a beautiful corally orange oh look at that so pretty um i was wearing this a couple days ago and then i have this revlon um hd sand lipstick and it is so out like it is dead it is out you guys but i don't want to throw it away yet oh my gosh such a beautiful shade and then two left this bare minerals marvelous moxie gloss in the shade maverick gorgeous nude so so pretty reminds me a lot of becca glow gloss this is a little thicker though um and then lastly this is one that you can't get anymore but it's by wet and wild and it is called love bird affair i'm running out of space and it's just a beautiful orange based red so pretty all right so that is that um those are the lip products that I trust to have with me. I really do love all of those so much. Um, lastly, I just keep a deodorant in here. And this is um, by Schmitz, which is a natural deodorant brand. And this is their rose and vanilla scent. So you guys can see it's more of like a chunky formula. Ugh, I hate saying that word, but it's kind of true. Um, and I like this because, because the scent is is yummy like it's a it's a nice scent rose and vanilla is like a nice scent um so i don't really have to bring an extra perfume in here this works both as a deodorant and as a perfume so it makes you smell nice in your armpits <laughs> your perfume is coming from your armpits um so yeah i really like having this around it is a full size but i don't really mind because um i don't have to carry a travel size like perfume or anything with me because of this so yeah I like it um the only two three things that i'm keeping in this front pocket from now on is this this and i think i'm going to move the dr papa rich mocha balm in here because i feel like it just has like a really nice pretty tint to it um and it's very natural and yeah i'm gonna move that to my purse anyway so that is what is in my purse you guys um i really like the backpack style right now um not only is it really trendy but it's also so so functional i love having an even distribution of weight on my back i love this nude color um if i didn't already go over that so yeah i really am in love with this purse and um everything that is in here is being really functional for me um i did have a lot of lip products so yes um i hope you guys enjoyed this video found it fun it was totally old school youtube um which i absolutely love i remember watching these videos back whenever i was like younger like 11 <laughs> and i would watch these videos so often because that's like that's what was popular five years ago um so yeah i seriously just thank you so much for watching um and i would love for you guys to subscribe comment down below um like this video i'd love to get to know you guys better and i I'd like to, for you to get to know me better. So yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>